freak. Hi friends, welcome back. We just got a bunch more cash money, which I am excited about. We also have not a lot of energy. We need to go to sleep earlier or something. I don't know. Maybe it's because we were exhausted yesterday. You think we'd sleep better, huh? All right, let's go water our plants and that'll probably use up all our energy. Oh, especially if we water the same one twice. Good one, Anton. Off to a wonderful start, Saturday the 20th. Let's see. I think this is the fourth day I'm recording right now. I kind of want to record one more after this, just because I want to play a Sunday. Did, did I water that plant three times? I swear to God. Oh my gosh, pro gamer. Using up all your energy. And then we don't even have enough energy to chop down trees. You know what? Maybe we just go right back to bed. Scoop will not want to talk. Eh, whatever. Maybe we just go right back to bed today. Let's just look around town, forge some stuff, see if we can get more energy by eating the random stuff we find lying around. And if that works out, then we can maybe find some more clay, which would be great. Okay, looks like our rice is still growing. That is the nice thing about rice. You can just kind of plant it and let it grow on its own in this game. Uh, Saturday, so Robin should be open if we can get a hold of her. Did Koopa wake up? Can we talk to him now? No, nope, still asleep. All right, well, that's fine. Do I have... Okay, Jody's request. I need a cauliflower, I need to get a level 40, and I need to build a coop. But we're working on that. We have enough money to build a silo and a coop. So the thing that's stopping us now is that we don't have the materials for either of them. And the other thing that's stopping us is it will take Robin a certain amount of time to, uh, three days actually, to do that. To build each building, I think, two or three days. Um, hopefully this is clay. I've never said that before, but... Okay, a lost book. Cool. So we could go check that in the library if we wanted to. I don't really want to. Um, but maybe someday we'll go read. <laughs> um, Shane's birthday. I don't have anything for him. We could do this. That's nice. nice. A nice, easy way to get some money and keep copper ore. Like, get extra copper ore. But I'm not really interested in going to the mines today. I don't really have the energy for it. We probably won't end up doing that. But it doesn't hurt you to take the quest, right? So if you don't mind having your quest log filled up with junk like that, you can always just take those help wanted quests. And if you happen to, um, you know, if you happen to complete them, like, great. And if you don't, no big deal. Yeah, so we're kind of just aimlessly wandering. Cool, uh, another daffodil. That's neat. I don't think we can... Yeah, okay, eating it doesn't give us any energy, so let's not eat it. The Bastion's here. Sorry about your eel, dude, but I needed it. Mm. Anything to forage around here? Probably not, because we already foraged in this area pretty recently. I asked, um... A few episodes ago, several episodes ago, I think, for people to leave comments about, you know, when I should release, what when they usually watch these, what they were doing while they watch them. Got a nice variety of responses. I think I did hear that some people did indeed watch these during lunch, which is amazing, which is great. It's a it's a lunch show sort of thing. Um, I'm here already. May as well say hi. Yeah, you know what? No, I'm gonna I'm gonna go say hi later. Oh, Jess. This kid, this kid is amazing. I do smell like grass. Very astute of you. Um, let's go down to the ocean and see if there's anything forged there. But yeah, so for those of you who, you know, watch this while you're having food. Or even if you don't watch this while you're having food, let me know what, uh, what sort of things you like to eat for lunch while you're watching this, or just like in general. Um, that'd be pretty neat. Another lunch show sort of thing. It goes with the theme, you know? It's uh, pretty clever what we're doing here. Not to, you know, not to toot my own horn or anything, but 
it's a, it's, it's a motif, one might say. It's sort of, it's sort of like, it's, you know, it's like poetry, sort of, they, they rhyme. I'm gonna stop talking, um, for a little bit. No, that's a bad idea. I should keep talking. No, no, that, it was a good idea. I, sh I should stop talking. Oh, Willie's fishing here. That's pretty neat. Let's see what he's doing. Got a bit more lively. You might expand the shop stock. Is that a... That feels like a hint towards the player to be doing something. But I cannot for the life of me tell what it is. <laughs> oh, I forgot there might be spring onions down here. <gasps> Can we get lucky and get a bunch of... No... No, no more spring onions. Okay. I guess they're only in season for a little bit. That's too bad. That would have been some good forage. We do get 25 energy from dandelions, though. It's not the worst thing. We might need, you know, we might do that. It's crazy how when you start looking for something, it's so hard to find it. No, that's, that's not true. I guess that might be like a some sort of bias, um, confirmation bias or something, selection bias. I'm not really sure. Because sometimes you start looking for something and you find it immediately, and you're like, "Wow, that's amazing! This is so lucky." And sometimes you're looking for stuff like forageables that you can eat and give yourself more energy now, <laughs> um, and you can't find them at all, or you're looking for clay. And it's hard to find clay. I don't know. It's hard, you know. Sorry, I mean, it's hard to tell if there's any sort of pattern to these things. I kind of doubt it. I think it's mostly just random, and it's just what you remember. Well, we have looked in a lot of different places and not really found anything. I guess these dandelions are it. I guess we just eat the dandelions and hoe up more clay and... Go back to sleep? Gosh, what a day. What a day. But tomorrow should be more fun. I don't know why, I just always think Sundays are just like a fun time. I don't I don't really know why. Maybe I'm just a, just a good church boy. That's not even a little bit true. Oh, cool, clay! I'm excited about that. More clay, please. Please. But, whoa, is he sleeping or is he awake? I can't tell. All right, whatever, Kufo. You know what? You just do you. I'll be over here. Yep. Yeah, boy. There's something over there, probably. Oh. Please, please, more clay. Okay. All right. We still have. We still pull up some stuff. I don't know what point you start to feel exhausted. Probably like 10% of your max health or something. Or maybe it's just like 20 energy or something. Let's just not get that far. It's already 4 p.m. So Robin will probably close pretty soon. So maybe not worth it to go up to the mountains. Okay, I can't go over here. Another thing, too, is it's difficult to chop down trees. Okay, cool. More clay. Good. Love it. When you have no energy, it's hard to chop down trees. Maybe I can eat that survival burger tomorrow. Or now. And cut down trees. <gasps> Let's see. Wait. This could be... This might be big brain. 125 energy. And plus three foraging. I think foraging helps you cut things down faster. So we might try that. Hmm. You know what? Yeah, let's do it. Because at the very least, we're going to need more. Um, we're going to need another chest, if nothing else. So let's eat that. Boom. And next there. How long does that last? Okay, five and a half minutes. IRL? Amazing. I don't even want to record for that much longer in this day, so... I don't feel any... Oh, you know what? No, it doesn't help us chop down trees faster. It helps us use less energy to, to cut them down. That's... which is just as important. 
I just chopped four times and I only used six energy, I think. Okay, great. This is amazing. Okay, yeah, so still difficult. Yeah, okay, because it's the it's your axe type that will determine how many strokes or how few strokes really it takes to chop down the tree. Um Okay, so I think we're foraging level two, but we're buffed up to five right now. Uh, yeah, so it's the it's the type of axe that will determine how many or how few strokes it takes to chop down the tree. But it's your foraging level that will determine how much energy it takes to do that. So we're at, okay, we got 50 more wood already. And we need to get to 300. Okay, this is going to be tough. This is going to be several days worth. So we start with the silo. And while the silo is being built, I think we just need to chop down trees on our farm. We also need to chop down trees on our farm. We can go down to like Cinder Sap Forest and chop down those trees. Yeah, this is already exhausting. I mean, we've burned through our like extra 125 energy or something just like that. Yeah, okay. So maybe we just chop down these little stumps. Not stumps, sorry. These little saplings. Okay, great. Um, that's pretty decent. Maybe we chop down a couple more of these things that are in our way. And let's build another chest. So I've been wanting one. And then we can get rid of this. I don't want that there. We can build this. No, don't need to put anything there. Oh, I don't want to add to existing sources. Is there this? Uh, okay, that's fine. Sap, yes. Wood, yes. Nice. Okay, good. That's pretty good. Okay, we can put away. Mm, I should really organize these chests. I can do that off stream, actually. Yeah, maybe I should do that off stream. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, sorry, off stream, like um, offline. Okay, great. So we still have four minutes left in our survival burger. So. Maybe we should have waited until tomorrow when we could make full use of that. Ah, well. That's okay. Let's wait 10 more minutes for it to get dark. Okay, good. Now it's dark. We can go to bed. We can actually go to bed at any time, but I just wanted to wait for it to get dark. I think we... Did we sell anything today? So we didn't. No, we didn't. Okay. Um. Okay. This is useless, but I just don't want it to automatically go to the next day. All right. That's all for now. I think I'm going to play one more. Okay, it doesn't matter if I'm going to play one more day now because you're not going to see it for, you know, a few days. But thank you guys for joining me. Um, yeah, kind of a kind of a no-op in, in a lot of ways today. Just kind of chilling out on the farm. But, you know, you got to have those days sometimes. You can't always be out fishing all day or going deeper into the mines or anything like that. So I've got some good stuff today. Hopefully we can find enough clay tomorrow to build that silo. That's something I'm really looking forward to. And uh, yeah, thanks again for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And this is not going to be very interesting because it's just a maple seed. Okay, cool. Five gold. Great. Anyway, thanks for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.